With the editor guides bracket pairs setting, VS Code will color the editor guides based on the matching brackets and braces in your current file. Now, you can see in this TypeScript file, for example, if you look over here at the editor guides, which are these lines that are currently indicating sort of the nesting level or the indent level of my code, these are all being given distinct colors. So we can see that for this if statement, for example, it's in this bright pink color here. For this inner if statement, it is in this kind of bluish color. And in this case, I've gone and turned on this setting, and I've also turned on highlighting of matching editor uh, or matching brackets and braces in the file as well. So the brackets and braces are being colored. You can see that the colorization of the brackets here, so the, uh, in this case, my cursor is inside of this if statement, and it is being enclosed by the curly brace up here and the curly brace down here. Those curly braces are being colored in this kind of pinkish color, and then the editor guide for that is also shown in the pink color here. And then if we look at this inner if statement, you can see that it has this bluish color for the brackets or for the braces that are enclosing it, and the editor guide for that one is also bluish. Now, as I move my cursor through the file, the active guide is going to be highlighted much more brightly than the inactive one. So if I put my cursor inside of the, into this inner if statement, you can see that the active guide is now much brighter than all of the other ones. And again, as soon as I go back to that outer if statement, that one is now much brighter. So it's very easy to visually tell apart where your, current, where your cursor currently is and which set of bra brackets and braces it is currently being enclosed by, just by moving through the file here. Now, the editor guide colorization is disabled by default, but it's quite easy to turn on. I'm just going to open up my settings with Control, comma, or Command, comma on Mac and search for bracket pair. And you can see that I've turned on the bracket pair colorization. So that is what was coloring the brackets themselves. But then we also have the editor guides bracket pair setting here. And you can see I've set this to true in this case, which is going to show all of the, um, or it's going to try to color in all of the editor guides based on the bracket pairs in the file. I can instead set this to active, which would instead only show the active um, editor guide here. So if I go back, you can see that all of the editor guides are shown, but they're no longer being colored in. And I'm only going to have the color for my currently active editor guide. So a little bit, it makes the uh, current the active editor guide stand out a little bit more. And I could also go and just turn off the setting entirely. So that is the default value. If I set it to false, I'll still get my editor guides if I have those enabled. But now they will no longer be colored in matched, uh, based on the matching brackets and braces in the file.